To move an object or image inside your Box SVG document, you need to have the top mouse pointer selected over here on your Tools menu. Then you would simply go ahead and click on your image, and then you can click and drag it around anywhere inside your Box SVG document. To change the size of this image, you can actually click on these blue boxes here and drag to change the size. If you hold shift on your keyboard while you drag, it leaves it in proportion as you move the image or as you drag the boxes around. If you want to go ahead and rotate the image, you click on it a second time. So now you have these red dots and yellow boxes. If you were to click on the red dots, you can go ahead and kind of freehand rotate your image around. If you were to click and drag on the yellow boxes, you do what's called a skew effect. So you're actually kind of warping it into a three-dimensional view. If you want to rotate a specific angle, you could go to the object menu, and right here you have it 90 degrees, positive or minus, listed here. So I can click rotate 90, and it'll do that. Or underneath the geometry panel over here, I could actually type in a very specific angle to rotate it. So I can rotate it 45 degrees exactly, or actually drag this little slider. Same thing if I want to set a very specific uh, position, I can type in a X or Y position, or the width and the height of the object. The units that you see here are listed in pixels, so if I want to make this 200 pixels wide, I could go ahead and type that in and then push enter.